Alrighty, folks, welcome on back to XCOM 2. Um, today we are protecting a device for a scientist, hopefully. Um, and let's see what the ground looks like when we get here. I know we start in a graveyard like area. Hostile forces are already moving to destroy the data tap installed nearby. We need to lock down the area and secure the device at all costs. Okay. We can do that. Let's see what's going on, shall we? All right, so here's a border, border, border. Oh, it's thin. It's so thin. All right, let's see what's going on. Whole bunch of snakes. Okay. Closing on target position now. Um, where is Sugar? There's Eli. Let's get him up here. Roger that. I know some of these positions aren't exactly the greatest, but uh, I'm trying to get everybody up as far as we can. Especially the guys that can shoot a lot. Let's keep our hacker back here. Hostiles making the rounds. Oh, cool! Some guys over there too. Overwatch. I wonder what they've got with them. I would really rather not find out <laughs> just yet. On the move. Moving to Overwatch. Okay, you can move all the way up. On los geht's. Mir entgeht nichts. And. Hmm. Yeah, I think here for now. Je me dirige vers les coordonnées. Je passe en vigilance. Well, let's see what these guys do. If anything. Well, they're moving that way. Is that a sectopod? Oh, that's that's definitely not good. That's going to be fun. Well, we can't see the snakes. And we can't see anybody, apparently. Oh, you can't see them, really? Oh, man. Yeah, he can't see them from where he's at. All right. Then let's move over here. Understood. Moving out. And get at least one really good shot at this sentinel. <laughs> Bye, sentinel. Not too shabby. We're visible here. Yes, we are. We got a small little group and four snakes, I think is what we're currently dealing with. Yep. Three mambas and an adder. And they just stood there. Well, that's that's interesting. We have an 89 on the elite heavy. Or Oh, I should have aimed for the car, too. <laughs> or, you have a hundred on the Elite he Wait, you can't see the Elite Heavy now? <laughs> Alright, we'll take out the Wrecker. That's kind of funny. One down, thousands to go. Really? You can't see anybody? Wait, you took an entire turn shooting one one light em up? Uh Oh, because I moved him, that's why. Okay. 
So let's I move here. It. And we'll shoot this heavy. Goodbye, Mr. Heavy. Target eliminated. Okay, I want to go see what else is down here. Moving out. Please say that's not a reveal spot. Oh! That's a lot of Archons and a Codex. Oh, that's two groups of Archons. Oh, I was hoping to be able to run and gun someone down here and street sweep them, but I don't think that's happening. <laughs> Not anytime soon, anyway. Okay, I'll go. A 24 is better than nothing. Especially when we can do some damage. I could run and gun over here. Hmm. Or I could just run to here. What is your shot chance? 28 and 24? Uh, how about just an overwatch? Can't see him from here, but you could see him from there. You can also see him from back here. And we do have both hail of bullets and chain shot. Chain shot is bad. Hail of bullets. That actually does a lot of damage. Nine damage, not bad. And he's on fire. All right, is that it? Yep. You burn for one. What else are we gonna do? Are you gonna move and mark? Are you gonna mark and shoot? Or are you gonna what? Okay, they're moving a little bit. Jeez, that thing does so much damage. You're gonna mark and shoot. Yep. Okay, six damage is not bad. What about the snakes? It's just one of you, and you missed. What about the other three? There's a Mamba. Ow. What about the other two Mambas? Jeez. You're just shooting everybody, aren't you? Ow. <laughs> All right. Well, we got an 86 here. Goodbye, Mamba. You know that was good. And a 75 on the Mamba back there. Only for seven. That's okay. You can see three, right? All right, well then let's do face off. Wait, I can only actually see one? Oh, because the others are, okay. Okay, okay, okay. That makes sense. You stay there. You go for that Mamba. Should have had you go for that Mamba to begin with. And... Yeah, why not? Go for that one, too. One health. 
Two health. Okay. We can deal with that in a second. As for the officer... No. Yes. Two and the car's on fire. Okay. Hmm. If I come up here, you can see the Adler, the Adder. All right, let's wait. Because I'm thinking of shadow falling this guy. Okay, now we got two guys in uh, concealment again. Let's come up to here. Orders confirmed. Moving out. And Overwatch. Hmm. Do I want a grenade back there? Yeah, that might not be a bad idea. Like right here. See how much of that we can actually destroy. Hey, puts him in the open. Just the two of you? Alright, so you reload. And... I could suppress him. Let's actually do that. Let's suppress him. And then you... Can move up just a little bit. And take out this Adler. Yeah. Alright. Find ausgeschaltet. Yeah, I was curious if he would burn to death or not. I figured I'd be, uh, what is it? Proactive about it as a just in case. Hi, guys. Blade storm? Blade storm. Yeah. And he's burning. Ha ha ha, nice. Oh. Why are you guys surrounding Oh. Hi guys. Wait, what? That activated the Sectoid Prime? Or we can just actually see him now. I've got two enemy turns left. And I don't like this. Alright. Well... With two enemy turns left, and all of these guys back here, I don't like that fire either. Let's see how we want to do this. How far does Street Sweeper go again? That far, okay. So let's see. Let me think about this for a minute. All right. So I have thought about it. I am going to... How do I want to do this? Yeah, I think I'm going to bring her... Oh, that's a long way around. Let's see if I can't fletch him from that side. From here. Oh, 
Oh, good. I can see everything now. All right. That's fine. And he's burning. Ha 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 ha. Okay. And then we're going to move up to here. To here. I think it was. And sweep the streets. Of these two, anyway. Yeah, these two. I missed a hundred percent shot on him. Oh, that's not good. That's definitely not good. Well, let's get him taken care of. Rock and roll. I'll do that in a minute. Okay. Apparently now you get to reload as well. Awesome. Alright. How many people can you actually see? Just two? Well, let's try a face off. There's three. And three. Awesome. Never actually used face off. I never actually used face off. Um, let's come up here. If you say so. And finish this guy off. Or do two damage to him. I guess that works too. Toss me some ammo. Okay, how about you? Can you finish him off, please? Thank you. Alright, what are you guys going to do now? Oh. Even better. Hair trigger. Of course. <laughs> still of up. course. Oh, and I still have you. Hmm. Didn't realize I still had you. What do we want to do? Yeah. Very nice. Very nice. And he's burning. Okay. So what are they going to do? Codex points. Archon burns. And codex points. Why does this keep happening? <laughs> like, this makes no sense. None whatsoever as to what's actually going on. Because I have no idea what is causing this. It's not one of those things that I'm going to um, not use. Because, obviously, I'm going to use anything I can to help. But, it's, it's definitely strange. This is definitely strange. Only a 42 on that codex? Alright. Let's steady. And then... We hit him. We activate them. Or we can come and take this guy out. Oh, look! Another one! These, they're giving me lots of Archons. Not sure what I'm going to be using all of these Archons for. Moving to position. But they're giving me a lot of them. Yeah. Okay. What is this hack? Small supply cache or a large supply cache? Ooh, supplies. Give it a shot. What does the negative do? I didn't pay attention. 
Negative. Group of reinforcements. That actually wouldn't be that bad. Question is, can we do that? Okay, let's just do the small one. <laughs> I'm glad I didn't do the large one, because, you know, <laughs> the small ones didn't work. Not getting anywhere. <laughs> well, at least they're coming in right here. That works. Okay. Uh, Overwatch. And let's move you up. I'm on it. And go into Overwatch. On Overwatch. Rücke zur Zielkoordinaten vor. Bestätigt. Überwachung läuft. Yeah, we're just gonna put everyone in Overwatch. C'est bon. Gern en cours. Because you know why not? They're gonna land. They're apparently not going to do anything again. And we get some reinforcements. Okay. Got a stun lancer, a grenadier, or a demolitionist. That looks like a captain. Oh, straight up close combat specialist. This could be interesting. Well, there's four damage. There's six damage. There's one down. <laughs> A shield lancer? Hi. Nice to meet you. You're gone. <laughs> what about the rest of you guys? Oh, hi. You're gone. <laughs> I forgot how useful Bladestorm was. All right, so we technically only have this guy over here to deal with. And he's actually not sitting behind anything. Not bad, not bad. Let's finish him off. Sorry, I just bumped my mic with my uh, hands. I was itching my nose. All right. So what is your chance on this codex now? 64. All right. Well, let's try it. Wow. Goodbye, codex. <laughs> that was like a what codex? All right. So these two are going to burn to death. So let's get this guy a little bit. And he's burning. Ha 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 ha. I love burning. All right. Light you up. Goodbye. Should have said shut you down. But you know. Light you up works too. Good to go. Okay, we'll reload here. And then reload. Overwatch. Moving to Overwatch. And same thing here. Reload. Let's do this. Overwatch. And you, I think, I'm just gonna have come over here and fletch this guy. And then we can watch the two of these guys burn to death. Alright. Oh! Hey, look at that. I had someone left. Bye. 
Bye. <laughs> All right. Now we just got whatever's left. Which could be quite a few. We're already at 20. We're already at 20. Jeez. All right. Well, let's move up. On your order. Slowly. Scanning. Because I don't know if it was just these guys or Whatever what it say. was. You you can grapple? Oh, you can only grapple to there. I'd prefer to grapple to like up here. So let's actually wraith you and we'll move you as far as we can. All the way over here. Just straight through everything. That's so cool. <laughs> um reload. An Overwatch. You can move up. Heading out. An Overwatch. And you can move up an Overwatch. I guess that'll be okay. Got it covered. Oh, forgot about you. Where do we activate them? Here. All right, so let's move all the way over here. Look at us. An Overwatch. Aucun problème. En vigilance. All right. I think you guys know what I'm gonna try to do. No problem, boss. On Overwatch. So, can you make it up? I think you can. Can you reconceal? No, of course not. You reveal there, so let's put you exactly here. Come get some. And then you... ...to here. To here, if it'll let me. Not there. Fine, there works. <laughs> All right, and then up. What's over there? Come get some. That that was not where I had clicked, but okay. Sure, that works. See, this is weird sometimes. It's like as soon as something gets in the way. Um, and for now, I'm just gonna have you steady. Yeah, I do know where they are. See what I mean by it's being like really, really funky weird? Okay, you move there. I can handle that. Jeez. Got it covered. You stay there for now. Stay there. Watch. Stay there. Oops, I should have moved him, but that's okay. Come up. Okay, I'll go. Overwatch. There. On Overwatch. I want to make sure everybody's in Overwatch before I grapple up here. Grappling. Because I think as soon as I do that, it's going to activate. Yep. At least one group. Wow. Let's take this shot. 11 damage through the armor. Oh. So that's what Annihilation Protocol does. Okay. That's not necessarily good. Okay. You. Now that I've reduced his hack defense. Let's take it. 
Let's see if we can't take it. I want to try to take you. Will you be mine? No. That's all right. He will not be mine. Can't get this one. However, oh, well, that took the whole turn. Okay. Um. Yeah. Let's go activate these guys. Set him up. Knock them down. Go, go, go. Objective located. Okay, good. Menace one five. We've got a line on the target. Move to protect that gear at all costs. Howdy, boys. It's nice to see you. Are we not doing anything? Hmm. Well, if we're not doing anything, I will be happy to throw a plasma grenade on you. <laughs> I was going to say, what do you mean immune? I don't like Annihilation Protocol anymore. Cool concept, but... Move into position. Oh, hi, Chrysalid. Welcome to the fight. Let's hit you one more time. Frag out. What does it say? Okay, well he's down to 26. He gets Annihilation Protocol again. Um, I want to fletch this guy from here. Hi. Time to meet my fusion blade. Nice. Got some advent here. Oh, hi. More advent. Hmm. Okay. Well, that's interesting. Uh, that is not where I'm clicking for you to go, you silly person. Sheesh. All right, get behind cover. And reload. Ready Next. Okay. Rocket. How come I can't see the rocket? What am I going to hit? Oh, okay. Well, then let's run and gun. To here. Well, I, didn't, I guess I didn't have to run and gun to go to there. But that's okay. And then rocket. Put back here on these guys. Can I get all of these guys? Can I? Can I? Pretty please? Does not look like it. Okay. These two are the only ones with armor left. So let's actually throw the rocket. There. That's what I know about Russia. Get some more armor shredded. That prime is going to be annoying. Can I chain shot the prime? Because that would be amazing. It keeps telling me I'm going to activate them, but they keep not activating. It's really weird. Okay, there's eight. And he's targeted, so the next one should be better. Nope, the next one missed. But it was a better chance. You and your annihilation protocol. Ah! Phew. You shot at the wrong person. 
You know that? They're still not doing anything. This is so weird. Alright. Goodbye. Mr. Prime. Pieces even made it up onto the roof. And he got death from above. I love death from above. All right. Uh, I want to take out this mech later, so let's drop down to here. Uh, I'm going. And let's start taking out these little guys. You know that was good. Another promotion. I'm loving these promotions. Nope, not the mech. This guy. The dudes that are actually, like, standing in the open yet? and are doofuses. I'll we'll leave you for now. You, however, need to move up. Did that not give you a shot? I was going to say, did that not give you a shot? Because it should have. Wow. Just left and right, left and right. Woof. I'm trusting you here. You see anything? No. Okay. Scanning. I got you and you and you. All right, well, what's in here and where is it located? I'd say we come get this guardian in the back. This one. Ah, ah, ah. From here. <laughs> it's like, okay, go back. Oh, look, a chrysalid. Kill confirmed. Hello, goodbye. Oh, almost. That was almost a goodbye. All right. And then I want to take out this guy back here. On your order. Nope. Yes. And now I have to run target someone eliminated. over there. I've located target assets. Cool. Um, well, let's go get it next turn then. Okay, Benotavix. Well, maybe next turn, I should say. Oh, hey, look. Reload. <laughs> I forgot about you. Forgot all about you. Sorry. Sorry about that. If you heard that, that was my ice in my cup. Okay. How about we take a sniper shot at the mech longbow? See what this does. Ouch. Okay. Bye bye. <laughs> Did you see that one? Yeah, yeah, we saw it. Dang. Why are we hitting all these now? When normally, you know, when they like run around, you can't hit anything. All right, I actually want to grab you and come up here and grab this loot. Strong box, auto loaders, lock box, sweet. Asset in tow. All right, let's get you to come over here and hit, I guess, the officer. 
Because you'll actually get him. And I should... Be able to get that Gatling Trooper with... Oops, I just passed her. With you. Yep. It's far enough away. Is that everything? Status confirmed. All hostiles are down and the area is secure. Status confirmed. Mission accomplished. Alright, well, I still can't find what's causing that, uh... Causing them to not take any actions. And I've asked around on forums, I've looked around on forums, and... Nobody else seems to be having the bugs. So I think... What I may do in between the next episode and this episode is back up my save. Um... And then completely uninstall and reinstall both XCOM and all of its mods. And we'll see we'll see if that fixes anything. Because I wonder if it's just like a corrupt file or a counter that's counting weird or something silly. But yeah, we'll have to we'll have to look and see. And this is taking forever. What is wrong with these loading screens? They're so long. And then, of course, if you don't want to get trapped under the Avenger, you have to wait like an additional five to ten seconds. Had that happen before. Alright, so two wounds is not bad. Decker got a promo. She got implacable. One or more kills on your turn, you're granted a bonus move. Ooh. And, alright, she is a ranger. Am I building her for crit? Alright, she's got crit. Center mass. Aggression, which is crit chance. Bring them on is... Plus one damage on crit hits for each enemy you can see. Rapid reaction is gives you a maximum of three reaction shots, or rapid fire is fire twice in a row. Okay. Um, I'm thinking of going Kabuki, Kabuki, Kubukiri. Sorry. Um, just because her. Her crit is so insane anyway. So Decker's crit build. You, I still need to... Ugh. I still need to fix this. Because you don't have Blade Master. So I'm going to leave you for now. Nope. And then... You're our interference... So, I think we're going to go with airdrop to get extra grenades. And... Our extra conditioning is running gun is cooled down. Aggression is crit chance for each enemy you can see. Let's kill your instinct. Running gun is 50% crit damage. Oh no, 50%. Yeah, crit damage. Oh. Yeah, I think we're going to go aggression. Try to make her into our uh, street sweeper. That would be amazing. Alright, Codex Brain, couple of strong boxes. Not a whole lot. Hello, Commander. But we did get our scientist. Awesome. So, reduced research time is good. We'll have a lab in three days. Um... The one is Howard. So let's go retrain Howard. Krauss is already being retrained as well. Okay. So when Krauss is done, how long does Krauss have? Five days. A uh, scientist. Oh. Five days for a scientist? Did we actually make contact down here? No. Okay, so we need to finish this. And then we can go try some other things.
All right. So we now have scavenger. The outcome of this research can only further our advances, Commander. All right. What does Sectopod give us? Central claims to have seen one of these things up close back in the day. Despite a lot of speculation, there was no pilot to be found once we pried it open. So, this gives us the Gremlin Mark III. Uh, when we first thought this thing was in, some of the troopers were still adamant that once we opened it up, we'd find a sectoid or worse at the helm. Fortunately, our precautions weren't necessary. There's nothing organic inside. No operator providing physical directions unless they're triggered it, triggering it remotely. All indicated... All indications point to this sectopod being an entirely autonomous weapon operating according to the parameters of its system programming. This is exactly the sort of weapon that would have raised eyebrows in the past. I know Dad would have been apprehensive about arming a robot and sending it on its way. It's pretty clear that at this point the aliens aren't bound by any moral or ethical obligations. It is efficient and destructive. They seem to have no problem setting it loose on us, Shen. And that gives us the Gremlin Mark III, which significantly increases hacking stat. Um, specialist abilities are also improved if he's accompanied by this support droid. So, what do we want now? I'm thinking plasma rifles. Um, at the same time, I would love to do a gatekeeper this autopsy. This specimen, henceforth referred to as the gatekeeper seems to harbor considerable psionic power as with the aliens other unique biomechanical field unit it will take some time to decipher the systems involved in its function okay let's finish off the 20 hours here the new lab facilities commander all right so Diesel lab. I've never had a lab in any of my playthroughs. Not a single one of them. Um, but I can stick scientists in here to reduce research time even more. Can we upgrade this? Well, we have the power, but we don't have the... Yeah, we have three power. And that needs five power. Okay. I was curious. I was curious. What happened to our Psy operative? Could Why I is it paused? You recruiting new staff for the engineering team, but as it stands, we have people still waiting Whoops. for an assignment. We can have them working on construction, excavation, or staffing a facility. All right. Where is our Psy? Psy operative is wounded. Okay, that's why they're not training. I was curious. Three days left on that. Reading you loud and clear. New regional contacts located. New bonus gained. All GTS tactics costs reduced by 50%. Okay. So we have 14 days left. I'd say we come and try to get this scientist Avenger real quick. New course. Before we take on that facility. Nice. Alright, so we can redo Kraus now. What was I going to do as Kraus? All right, let's see here. I think we're going combat specialist. Oh yeah, trench gun was what I wanted. Um, do I want lightning reflexes? Or Killer Instinct. Let's do Killer Instinct. Um, 
Aggression for the extra crit. I don't want hit and run. I want rapid fire. Let's see here. Bring them on is extra crit damage. Yeah, bring them on. And... Rupture is nice. Lethal is really nice. Um... Oh, I'm thinking I'm going to go with lethal for the extra damage. All right. So we got Kraus. Now, who is the other one we wanted? We wanted Howard. Howard. Yes. All right. How long left? Five days. We'll get insanity in two. There's insanity. What else do we want? Schism does a small amount of guaranteed damage and applies rupture. Or is surrounded by an aura that immediately extinguishes or blocks mental impairments for themselves and nearby squad mates. I think for now we're going to go with Schism. And the Shadow Chamber will be done Shadow here in a minute too. Now operational. And we got the Achievement Codebreaker. Although I'm impressed with the strides we've made in infiltrating the alien psionic network. The depths of their technological advancement continue to leave us one step behind. However, with the enhanced decryption capabilities of this chamber, I'm confident we will find a great deal more information than we had previously hoped. New objective added. Okay, that was cool. With the shadow chamber fully operational, we can use its advanced decryption capabilities to analyze the codex artifact recovered by our forces. So, if I do this, it puts our other one on pause. So I'm going to wait. Um, because I really want to see what that, the gatekeeper autopsy gets us. Incoming message for you, Commander. Patching it through to your quarters now. Leading the resistance is a daunting task, Commander. But your efforts so far have left many wondering if we have made the right approach. We will have to do better. Hey, we did just fine. All right, what is this? This is vigilance so alert. This one's going to be the most annoying. So if I can, I'm going to do that one. Um, when it pops up. Yeah, I know we have supplies. Let us continue scanning for 22 hours. I think I could have predicted this outcome, though it is intriguing. I have come to suspect that this creature's unusual appearance is somehow directly connected to its notable psionic aptitude. The aliens always have some reasoning to their actions, even as twisted as it is often revealed to be. So this gives us the alien psyamp. Um, having encountered a number of aliens capable of wielding psionic power, it should come to no surprise that the aptitude and abilities are often unique to a given species. In this case, the subject henceforth referred to as Gatekeeper. It is on the extreme end of the spectrum in terms of psionic sensitivity. However, our efforts to analyze the subject um, have so far revealed little in terms of its actual purpose or intention in the field. Unlike the Codex, so far we've found nothing that would allow the Gatekeeper to open or control a rift all occurrences indicate are all current indications point to an unusually independent unpredictable species and the psi amp is this version of the psionic amplifier incorporates artifacts from the powerful gatekeeper aliens we've encountered we'll put our par exper experienced psi operatives on the same level as the aliens most powerful psionic forces awesome well let's Let's put on a strong I'll box work begins immediately, and throw I'll the codex brain in here. 
Because, yeah, this, this pauses the actual research being done. Um, three days until retrain is done. We got another scientist. Do I have enough time to get the supply? I think so. Avenger Let's go get supplies. Please say we can get all three, because that would be... Commander, we're making progress piecing this thing back together, but it hasn't been pretty. Our soldiers completely disabled this unit in the field. What we're hearing is merely a byproduct of electrical impulses. I assure you, it is well past the point of feeling hate. I'll take your word for it, Doctor. I'm sending you a new secret now. These are coordinates. Return coordinates. Think we've got a point of origin. Well, part of one. Something else. Something underneath. One more. is attempting to block further access. That's not all it's doing. I'm losing the data we've already decrypted. Almost there. Just one more adjustment. Forget the data. It's accessing the power core. Overriding my safety. Increasing power levels to dying and sever the connection. There. Some sort of fail-safe protocol, I imagine. The Codex must have intentionally overloaded the interface to prevent any further theft of information. Still, I believe I was one step ahead. That's an enormous amount of data. Yes, and I expect it may take some time to decipher. Better get started. I don't think we're going to be able to do that again. <laughs> nope. I'll proceed with the necessary research and preparation. With your approval, of course, Commander. I'd also suggest we look into those coordinates. That's if I can reconstruct the data we lost in the transfer. I just hope it was worth it. Me too. New objective added. Decrypt the Codex data. We're okay. making progress, Commander. I've updated our objectives based on the latest findings. In the field. The Codex appears as an anomalous form in an almost constant state of flux, seemingly only present in our world for milliseconds at a time. However, it was apparently not immune to the effects of conventional weaponry, having dissipated before leaving behind this object. All right, so more reading. Yay! The Codex itself is a remarkable entity, far beyond our expectations of what a sentient biological organism could or should be. Our limited exposure to it leaves a number of open questions, and it has, and it, and as it appears to phase or flux out of our visible spectrum, it will undoubtedly prove to be a difficult specimen to study. In any case, our troops were able to recover what can only be described as the Codex brain, a central processing unit encompassing data storage, communications, tactical control, as well as a host of other functions we've yet to identify. With the Shadow Chamber in place, Shen and I conducted a thorough, albeit difficult, series of experiments to unravel the mysteries of the device. Through a series of high-frequency exposures, we were successful in forcing the Codex to reveal itself, beyond the confines of the brain alone. Shen expressed varying concerns about the well-being of the Codex as it appeared to be responding and even resisting our efforts to decrypt the data and access the Advent Network. I assured her any indication of pain or active intolerance of our testing was merely a byproduct of the procedure. Before the Codex destroyed itself, along with our containment area, we did manage to recover a subset of the data containing what appears to be a set of map coordinates. It will take some more time to work through the remaining fragments, but in the interim, we have a lead to pursue. Tygen. All right, so now we can view the archives, which is the Codex brain. And that should have switched Our back over here to research, yeah. Commander. New objective added. 
It All right. Like we've got our work cut out for us, Commander. So, I now have to make more contacts. Sweet. Howard is done retraining. So, Blade Master. And Shadow Strike. Cutthroat. Blade Storm. Okay, now we have a choice. Shadow Step does not trigger Overwatch or Reaction. Bonus to crit hit enemies. Gain 25 dodge against attacks within four tiles. I think we're going to go with does not trigger overwatch. Alright. Let's finish this off. As everyone's recovering from wounds. Alright. Let's go to the black market Avenger real quick. Plotting new course. Market is open. Because I believe anything called love but beyond that I believe I have a whole bunch of stuff to sell I have big boy three sectoids seven chrysalids what's that for hell weave yeah we can sell some of them um tons of troopers what are they used in nano scale and exosuit yeah let's sell some officers some vipers some faceless Lots of mutons, lots of shield bearers, some mechs. We can sell all the regular lockboxes. Um, you're made with the spider suit. Alright, let's see here. Archon. We have 19 Archon corpses. There we go. Lyrium core, good strong boxes. Sweet. 346 supplies. Alright, and if we go back to buy, what can we get? We can get an engineer, we can rush research on the plasma rifle, which might not be a bad idea. Ethereal reliquary. I'm tempted to buy it just to see what it is. I'm going to do it. I'm going to buy it to see what it is. <laughs> uh, we've got plenty of Illyrium and alloys. All right, now back to Hello, engineering. Let's get... That's 200 supplies, so yeah, let's get an alien Siamp online. We'll get a gremlin online. We'll get the Sten gun online. And a grenade launcher. And that's it. All right, well that was a nice upgrade. So now, if we go back here, I should be able to go over to New Chile. Commander, we've had the Shadow Chamber running the numbers. These are the tactical projections for our next field operation. And it tells me who's here. Nice. All right, we've got a Gatekeeper, a Codex, an Elite, a Spotter Mech, a Spotter Sectopod. Oh, great. A Sectopod Any and a... For Sector Ugh. Chile. All right, it's all right. All right, let's clear the squad and make everything available. So I do have another mod that tells me all of this right here. So we've got a spotter mech, a spotter sectopod, a gatekeeper, a codex, an elite officer, an advent seeker drone, a wrecker, a shield bearer, and an advanced shield lancer. And we still have so much for notoriety. So let's bring Alonzo and Kolinik and Jones. What else do we have? Let's bring the other Jones. Two Shinobis never hurts. Um, right. Let's bring Suleiman and hope he doesn't get hurt. Kraus is out for a long time. Uh, let's bring O'Reilly. And... Second... Let's bring a... Sh yeah. Alright, so you get... This Scatter Blaster. And... 
the hunter's axe, and the war suit. And instead of a plasma grenade, I think I'm going to give you... What do I want to give you? Hmm. I think I'm going to go with the hazmat vest. Just so that she has a ton of health. Alright, and O'Reilly gets... Well, I don't really want a laser sight. Alright, fine. Let's do this one. You get... Nope. Okay, so you stay with that. You get a Mark III. But instead, you get... Um... Big Boy. And a Med Kit. And I might as well give you this Skull Jack as well. Even though currently it can't do anything. I need to upgrade that. I need to upgrade that soon. Maybe after we get some more supplies. Alright. So you get slim. You can have a regular pistol, a plasma grenade, and we'll give you venom rounds. Um. Right. Can have this pulse rifle. Um. I'm going to give him the Talon Rounds and the Mimic Beacon. And then, which one of you is Slashy? You are! Okay. And so what does that make this Jones? Okay, good. You're the one who can reconceal. Okay. So, you get the Pulse Sten Gun SMG. Uh, we'll give you... No, not Vampire. We'll give you this one. And you get Slick and the Battle Scanner and a Grenade, I think. Alright, our Psy Operative gets just a regular pulse rifle, the alien psyamp, a plasma grenade, and dragon rounds. A sharpshooter gets sugar. <laughs> the wraith suit, shadow keeper, and blue screens. And last but not least, our other shinobi gets a pulse sten gun, the vampire fusion blade, do we have any other cool ones? No. Alright, a plasma grenade and a med kit. There we go. Alright, now we have a PCS and a couple regular upgrades we could do. So what are the regular upgrades? We got an auto loader. Okay. I'd rather give the auto loader to somebody else. So we'll wait on that. And what's the PCS that we got? Oh, I can't do it that way. PCS, we've got will and HP. Alright, so let's give you HP. And we'll give our Psy Operative more will. There we go. 96 will and over 100 Psy. So, this is going to be our squad for sabotaging the alien facility. Um, we are going to take Alonzo, Kolinick, Jones, Jones, Wright, Suleiman, O'Reilly, and Garcia. And I will catch you folks in the next episode, and stay frosty out there.